The one thing that stops most drivers from trying more challenging terrain is confidence. They don't want to try something because they've never tried it before. There's lots of features in there. It's got a uh, full-time uh, four-wheel drive system. That gives you the option of four high, four auto, or four low. The four auto is the one where it can determine which wheels have traction and then it can transfer torque accordingly. We've improved the selectable drive modes, so the Everest is optimised for as many different terrains and conditions as possible. Mud ruts makes the downshift more aggressive and the upshift later. And sand mode recalibrates the traction. If you really want to be a successful off-roader, you've got to really read and visualise the terrain that's in front of you. The off-road screen is incredibly useful for looking over blind crests to avoid obstacles. It's got the dynamic lines, it shows you the path the wheels are going to take, but it also shows you the, uh, the flank of the vehicle, which can be helpful for guiding you. So as soon as you select one of the off-road modes, automatically the off-road screen comes up and the diff lock is engaged. It instantly says this is a serious 4x4. All those features are available, they can be switched on and off, they can set it up to the way they like it. Some of these features that the vehicle's got allows them to push themselves a little bit further out of their comfort zone and you know, once they get that experience then they'll be able to uh, use the vehicle to its maximum potential.